Hi, I'm Henry, and I've got a question from Katie. She asks, I've heard women have less ribs than men. Are there any other differences between male and female skeletons? Well, I'm sorry to say that females have the same amount of ribs as men. Uh, but there are other things that you can look at when you're looking at skeletons to see if they're male or female. Now, to start with, children, it's very difficult to tell if they're male or female. But once they become adult, you, there's a few things that you can look at to try to identify if they're male or female. Now, what I have here is a skull. And this one's a male. The reason I think it's a male is because, see, his eyebrows, these bony parts in his eyebrows, they're quite thick and robust. And that's during evolution, males would fight and having a big, robust skull would help when somebody's battering you, you with a stick. So, thick, robust eyebrows. If you look around here, there's a big, lumpy thing here, which there's one on the other side as well. And these are big and heavy because the muscles of a male are usually a lot bigger than the muscles of a female. And this shows that Large muscles were attached to that, so that's why I think it's male as well. Go around the back of the skull, you'll see this little nobly bit, right at the very back, right there. And females quite often don't have this. Sometimes they've got little ones, but sometimes they've got none at all. But this one is quite large, and this again is for muscles to attach to the, the, the back of this skull. So that's why... I think this is a male skull. There are other ways to identify if a skeleton's male or female. It's easier in some bones than it is in others. So this is a pelvis and I believe this is a pelvis of a male. If you have a look at the angle that this makes, it's quite tight. It's, it's like a, a V. It goes like that. But if you look at a female pelvis, it's not a tight V, it's, these points are quite spread out. So it's a bigger angle. Also in a female, this hole here, if you uh, look down it, is really quite large. That's to help with childbirth. If you look at a male pelvis, it's quite a lot smaller, so you'd never get a baby out a hole that size. So I hope that helped answer your question, and please check out my other two videos uh, on bones. Uh, thanks very much for watching. Bye. Bye.